Hey y'all, what's up? My name is Avery and today I'm going to be talking about Dreamers by Yui Morales. <laughs> Dreamers by Yui Morales is a book that I read recently and I really, really, really enjoyed. So I thought I would tell y'all all about it and what I thought about it. This is obviously a children's book, if you couldn't tell, a children's picture book that has some beautiful, beautiful artwork in it and I'll tell you all about that in a little bit. But this book is about a mother and a son. You can obviously see them on the cover right here. This is a book all about a mother and a son immigrating to America. I believe from Mexico, from what the pictures show me, because it's not explicitly stated in the book, but there are pictures representing the country. So this book is about them immigrating to America and them going through a lot of struggles, being very confused and kind of feeling alone in this new country of theirs. Then they find a place called the library <laughs> and they find themselves in books in the library. It's so beautiful. You get to see some beautiful artwork done um, in this book. That's the main thing that I loved about this book was the art in it. There are some colors through the entire book, but it's a little bit more dreary and gray and brownish throughout the book when they're living in America now. But then once they find the library and find books like the pages just explode with color and images and life and it really shows how these two characters finally find themselves and feel like accepted and find a place in the world that's theirs through these books and the library. Everything just pops out of the page and it, it's just gorgeous and Yura Morales actually illustrated this whole book herself. She wrote it and illustrated it and I think that is so cool. She painted with acrylics and drew on paper with ink and brushes and she also scanned photographs including the floor of her studio, the girl where she girls her quesadillas, childhood drawings, a chair. Like that is so awesome. I really loved the illustrations in this book for sure. I really enjoyed this. I've never read a book about immigration at all, so I feel like this would be a great book for children to helpfully understand what it means and maybe also be a great representation for people who are also immigrants to America and show them how they can also find their place in a world that may be different than the place that they came from. Since I am going to be a teacher, I would definitely have this book in my classroom. I'd love to again show kids what immigration means and um, how it can be beautiful and how it could also be difficult. And maybe if there are students in my class who are also immigrants, this can be a great book to show them how they are included and seen in my class. This book is an own voices novel. In the back of the book, there is a section called My Story, and Yura Morales talks about how this book is inspired by her own experience because in 1995, she immigrated to America with her son as well. She talks about in her story, in her my story part of the book, how she felt alone and she like missed the things that were familiar in her life, like her family and food and the way that you went about your life in Mexico. That's definitely portrayed in this book through these characters and the illustrations. Overall, I would definitely rate this book a 10 out of 10 books. Books are a huge reason why these characters start to love where they are living and start to feel accepted, they find themselves in these books. And it is beautiful and amazing because I find myself in books all the time too. And I love how these characters were finally able to feel accepted because they found the library. That is so cool. I really enjoyed this book and I hope that other people out there pick this book up to read to their kids or their students. I feel like this is a great, beautiful book to share with others. But anyways, thank y'all so, so much for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Please let me know down below if you have read this book or any other multicultural children's books that I should check out. But anyways, thank y'all so, so much for watching. I will see y'all soon in my next one. Bye.